welcome to pre-math in this video we have got this uh, small and large semicircles they are put together as you can see in this uh, diagram such that this uh, code for uh, larger semicircle is tangent to this uh, smaller semicircle and the length of this code is 16 units and now we are going to calculate the area of this uh, blue shaded region please don't forget to give a thumbs up and subscribe let's go ahead and get started and here's our very first step let's recall uh, the circle theorem the angle between the radius and the tangent will always be 90 degrees as you can see in this uh, diagram where this is our radius and this is our tangent line and the angle between them is going to be 90 degrees so therefore the radius for this uh, smaller semicircle is going to be perpendicular to this uh, chord and this angle has got to be 90 degrees and moreover this line is going to be perpendicular to this uh, chord as well since these two lines are parallel let me call this uh, radius for this uh, smaller semicircle as a lowercase r then this uh, length is going to be lowercase r as well and now let's recall the perpendicular bisector theorem if a radius of a circle is perpendicular to a chord then the radius uh, bisects the chord and in our case we can see that this uh, line is part of the radius of this uh, larger semicircle and this is a perpendicular to this chord so therefore this uh, line is going to bisect this uh, chord into two equal parts if this whole length is 16 units then this length is going to be 8 and this is going to be 8 units as well in this next step i have connected these two points this center and this point and we can see that this is the radius of this larger semicircle let me go ahead and represent this radius by uppercase r and here's our much nicer looking diagram and here's our next step we know that the area of this uh, blue shaded region is equal to the area of this uh, larger semicircle minus the area of this uh, smaller semicircle and now let's recall the area of a circle of formula area equals to pi r square so therefore the area of a semicircle is going to be pi r square divided by Two, isn't it now let's look at the area of this uh, larger semicircle we know that the radius is uppercase r so the area of this uh, larger semicircle is going to be pi r square divided by 2 and likewise the area of this uh, smaller semicircle is going to be a pi r square divided by 2 where this radius is lowercase r as you can see in this next step where this is the area of the larger semicircle minus the area of a smaller semicircle and now we can see pi divided by 2 is in common let me go ahead and factor pi divided by 2 outside so we are left with the r square the uppercase r square minus the lowercase r square we call this our equation number one and now let's focus on this uh, triangle abc and we know that this is a right triangle so therefore we are going to use the pythagorean theorem and here's our pythagorean theorem a square plus b square equal to c square in our case this is our longest leg let me go ahead and call this side c i'm going to call this side lowercase a and this our lowercase b now let's go ahead and fill in the blanks in this pythagorean formula a in our case is 8 square plus b in our case is lowercase r so it's going to be r square equal to uppercase 
r square. Let's move this uh, r square on the right hand side. So therefore we are ended up with the uppercase r square minus uh, lowercase r square equal to 64. Now let's focus on this equation 1. We have a r square minus r square. I'm going to replace uh, this value which is 64. So I'm going to replace this one by 64. So therefore I can write pi divided by 2 times 64. Let's go ahead and simplify that is going to give us 32 pi. And we know that the pi value is approximately equal to 3.14. So therefore the area of this blue shaded region is going to be approximately equal to 100.53 square units. So thus the area of this blue shaded region turns out to be 32 pi square units. And this is approximately equal to 100.53 square units as well. Thanks for watching and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos. Bye.